Hello, hello, everyone. My name is Chris Schweda out of the New Orleans, uh, Louisiana market. And um, it's my incredible opportunity or privilege to share with you guys tonight, you know, what has happened for us in the last year? What, you know, what has all this buzz been around, around happy coffee and... and... No, just kidding. We're going to get something beautiful, but... What is happy coffee? All right, now I have everyone muted. Um, so with that being said, guys, um, again, uh, and I'll just share a little bit about my background. Um, I was a horseshoer. Literally, I, I spent my day under horses, but um, every single day putting shoes on horses' feet. Um, I saw this, uh, this, this way that you can basically do community marketing and share products that give value to people. And it's literally changed my life over the last um, you know, 15 to 20 years and what has happened for our family. Well, three years ago, I got sick and my whole life was turned up, upside down. I went from making an amazing amount of money, um, having an impeccable credit score of over 800. Um, I had, uh, you know, we had bought our dream boat, which our family is very big into wakeboarding and surfing and all that and bringing the family out every week. Um, and my whole life was turned upside down due to a bone infection from a surgery, which we did not know exactly what it was uh, to start, but I was bedridden for four months. Um, with that, what I saw happen was is my income had gone down and, and things just started to change. I went from having some of the best health insurance to uh, not being able to afford insurance anymore. And it was extremely trying time. Um, and one year ago, uh, literally September, I had a surgery, cleaned it all out, um, had to do all kinds of stuff with antibiotics. But financially, you know, my life was literally turned upside down. I was not in the most empowered state, to say the least. And with that came, um, you know, stress, anxiety, uh, what I guess I would call depression, which I never thought of myself as being one that was depressed. I'm not talking about, you know, depressing my head in between my legs, but just basically uh, not me. I just did not feel like myself. And a good friend of mine had shared with me that um, he had basically invested into a company that was a travel business. It was a public company and they had sent him some coffee. And he's like, I drink coffee. I'm going to try this stuff. And, and what I started to hear, he, he was sharing these stories with me on what was going on with this coffee and was saying, you know, you really need to take a look at this. And I was, at the time, uh, to say I was skeptical is, is an understatement. Uh, to think that coffee would do all the things that he was sharing with me, you know, really just blew me away. With that, um, I was like, you know what? I think I'm going to try it, just based on hearing his story and what had happened. Tried the product, I tried the coffee, and I was blown away by the way that I felt. I felt extremely euphoric. I felt... A, a sense of, of like peace, you know, going through all the stress that I was going through. And I was just like, this is, is wild. Um, and the funny part about it is, you know, um, by the way, it's called Elevate. And why is it called Elevate? Because it says on the bag, it elevates your mood, um, curbs cravings, burns fat, boosts memory, enhances clarity, increases energy. And I was like, that makes sense. Like, you know, if a coffee will do that, I'll, I'll, I'll try it. And um, what I can say is what I felt on the coffee blew me away. And I just started sharing with some friends going, have you heard about that happy coffee everyone's talking about? Which at the time I was the only one talking about it and Mark. And um, you know, what happened, what we saw happen through that was people were just automatically open to trying out a different coffee because people already drink coffee. I don't know if people recognize that. We might have some people on this call tonight that are like, you know what? I'm not a big coffee drinker. We have many people that did not drink coffee before that now are drinking coffee based on the way that they feel. But for all of you non-coffee drinkers, we have something called chocolate vape, which is a hot chocolate that you literally mix in water. And um, it does all the same things that the coffee does. You can get it either in the coffee in a tub or you can get the bag of sticks. So with that, we also have another product called um, Xanthamax, which I couldn't pronounce when we first got started. So I called it the happy pill because these two things together, guys, literally releases all the happy chemicals. And honestly, I, I didn't know how to pronounce most of them. Um, I definitely couldn't spell them. 
But what I've heard over and over and over, so now I can repeat it, is dopamine, oxytocin, serotonin, and endorphins are naturally being released in your body because of taking these products. And guys, we're not going to get into a bunch of, you know, uh, science tonight. I'm not going to try to claim to be a scientist and start explaining all of the different things. But what I can share with you is that what I've heard the doctor say is that what these do through nootropics is balance out your hormones to where your brain naturally releases all the happy chemicals. Um, so what people are feeling, that euphoric feeling, is that natural high that you get from the happy chemicals um, that are being released because you drank a cup of coffee and you took this happy pill. Guys, there is so much science behind this one pill uh, from a perspective of antioxidants and all kinds of stuff. I'm not going to try to repeat all the things that I've heard, but what, I could, what I've seen and what I've heard from a story perspective on taking this product has absolutely blown my mind. So instead of me trying to break all this stuff down, I'm going to see if I can figure out how to do this because I'm not a big tech guy. But I'm going to see if I can basically play a quick three-minute clip that's going to break down what does the coffee and the Xanthamax do together. And then you can make an educated decision on, hey, I might want to try that stuff. So I'm going to um, click over here real quick, see if I can figure out this whole thing. Here we go. I'm going to share screen and play this. study in history. Harvard University has been studying happiness since 1938 in the ongoing Harvard study of adult development. It's been tracking the lives of over 700 men and women for the past 77 years. And it's one of the most, if not the most, detailed and lengthy studies on happiness ever. The results are staggering and shows that happiness is not necessarily what you think. More recently, another Harvard alum and one of the world's leading experts on Hey, Chris, we can't hear the sound. It's via its network of neurotransmitters now? to release the chemicals yeah, of hormones sorry. and make us feel happy. Modern science, as well as Ricky, can you hear? Yes, sir. Yes, so sir. Now, what these chemicals and hormones are. Dopamine, oxytocin, serotonin, and endorphins. Let's call these our positive neurochemicals. When your brain releases one or more of these neurochemicals, you feel good. As humans, we're always looking for ways to turn on these happy chemicals. Introducing Oats. E-O-S-E -E is the way you're a happier, healthier you. Oats is led by the world's first wood book used for long with that for humans. Combined, they are capable of getting their brain to release all four of these positive neurochemicals at the same time. advantage and become more productive with a greater sense of well-being and elevate your life 
get your dose of happiness today. Okay. Uh, thanks, Ricky, for letting me know that I screwed it up. I'm muting it. <laughs> so, guys, that's just proof that you don't have to be a rocket scientist to create success in this. And uh, the reason why we've been able to do so well and so many people have been, been doing so well is because, guys, it's so simple. It's coffee. And to open this up, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn and, and have some people share their stories so where you can see that it's not just my story, it's, it's story after story after story. And I'm going to start it off uh, with Tommy Wyatt. Tommy, you out there, brother? Hey, I am out here. Uh, am I unmuted? Yes, sir. Share, share what has you excited. How, how do you yes, feel? Uh, thank you so much, Chris. Thanks for asking me to, to, uh, to speak tonight. Yeah, you know what? I, um, I, I joined this company by accident back in uh, the middle of June. I, uh, I'm not a health and wellness person. When I, when I first heard about what you guys were doing, I, I wasn't even interested in it in any way. Uh, I didn't know any of the facts. I didn't know anything about it. My friend Mark Willitson was trying to tell me about it, and I didn't even want to hear it. Uh, I feel a little silly about that now because that was last November. Uh, but um, he sent me, he, he said, that's all right. And he, he, in, uh, in May, he sent me some coffee. And I said, I do drink coffee. So, you know, I'm I'm not a health and wellness guy. I'm not into supplements or milkshakes or, you know, all those things, protein shakes, pills. I don't want to do any of that kind of thing. I'm a, I'm a bourbon and, and ribeye steak guy. So I wasn't interested in what I thought was going on over there. And he sent me the coffee and I started to drink it. And I need to tell you, like day number one, I drank a cup of the coffee and it's hard to explain. And I almost feel, I almost feel silly trying to explain it to people because it sounds like Fantasy Island. Uh, I, I immediately started to feel like energy and focus and clarity. And, and, and again, it's, it's hard to put it you know, in words. Uh, and end of the day, I realized I forgot to eat. I, I forgot to eat, like something that never happened to me in my whole life. Uh, the next day, it, it happened again. I drank the coffee in the morning. I felt great immediately. I uh, wasn't really hungry all day. You know, I had a snack here and there, you know, a light meal. Uh, all of a sudden, what started to happen was I was starting to lose weight, and I was feeling great every day. Now I'm losing weight. Now my wife wants to try it. Then she starts losing weight. Then I said, you know what? There's something crazy going on here. So I flew out to Dallas uh, to the national convention that they were having it in, you know, end of June, and got to meet the culture, meet the people that were that were you know in the company. And I said, you know what? Not only do I love this product, and will I drink it every day? I want to be a part of what's going on here. I just, I just loved what was going on. I said, you know, this, this might just be the once in a lifetime thing that everybody always talks about. And I need to tell you, now that I've been in the business, July, August, September, now October, I, I am so, so happy. I know a lot of people around here just looking at the product as a customer, and that's great because that's kind of the way we do it here, which is another thing that I love. Uh, I, I share coffee with people. I now, just on my team alone, I probably have no exaggeration. I probably have 75 testimonials from people that are just saying, I just drank the coffee and my life is changing, you know, from all these, you know, blood pressure meds, I'm off, you know, all, all these crazy, I mean, they're not medical claims, but they're just real testimonials, but everybody's losing weight, feeling better, having energy. It's just one thing after another. So my life has changed. My whole family's lives have changed. And uh, I'm in a business right now where I, I can't remember ever being this excited. So I, I'm super, I'm just super amped to be here. This is a great spot to be. Awesome. Thanks so much, Tommy. Uh, now we're going to turn to one of the ladies. Kim, are you out there? Hello. Hey, Chris, this is Kimmy. I don't know if you're calling Kim or Kimmy. Um, either one. Okay, I'll go ahead and start. Um, I've been, actually, I got into drinking this coffee because of Kim. So we kind of got the Kim duo going on here. Um, but for me, I've been drinking it since this summer, and it totally has given me my purpose back. I've been through a lot of personal things going on in my life, and I am back on top again, and I have energy, and I have drive and purpose, and I'm just really excited about it. And I have my dad over here. He's 88. There he goes. And he's been drinking the coffee. And um, almost a year ago, we put my mom in a memory care facility. So 
and I are now roommates and having a good time, but he was a little sad, you know, with mom not being here after 68 years of being together. So I got him drinking the coffee. But dad, tell him what, what it's done for you. And at 88 years old, I am one happy, happy today because I was introduced to the happy coffee. It has changed my mood because at 88 and losing my wife, my mood has not been very pleasant. But with happy coffee, my mood is now one of, hey, I can't wait to get the second cup. <laughs> I am really enjoying whose ever invention this is. Congratulations to you, sir, and or ma'am. <laughs> Bye-bye. See you later. <laughs> family affair here. We've got my brothers and sisters on it and um, we really enjoy our coffee and it does elevate our mood and elevate um, our memory and, and our um, desire to get up and go and do things and at 88 he has not thrown down any. So um, Anyway, I, it makes me very happy when Pappy's happy. <laughs> Thank you so much, Kimmy. Okay. Now I guess we'll turn it over to Kim. Kim Fang. Hey, Chris. I'm sorry. I kept trying to press the button. Wait and come. I uh, was in network marketing for seven years, and I think I got burnout, and I stopped, and Tony would not let me alone, and she kept telling me, you got to try this, you got to try this, and I just would not, so she sent me some. I do not like coffee, first of all, <laughs> so that was a problem I had to get over, so I started drinking it. And immediately I started feeling happier. I started feeling a motivation that I've never ever felt before. Uh, within a month and a half, I dropped 16 pounds. And now I am, I've dropped 26 pounds. I was on Wellbuterin for two and a half years for depression. I lost my mom and I had, I'm a cancer survivor. And that really put me in a big state of depression. Uh, I went to my doctor, showed it to him, and he was totally amazed. He told me that it all looked good. Go ahead. If it made me feel good, do it. I did it. I weaned myself off. I would not suggest that, but I weaned myself off of my Wellbuterin. And... I made the mistake of trying to take a break uh, last week. And I woke up one morning and my husband looked at me. He said, what are you doing? And I said, I'm getting my coffee. He said, can I ask you something without you biting my head off? And I said, yeah. He said, did you drink your coffee yesterday? And I said, no. I said, I took a break. He said, please don't never do that again. He said, you snapped at me so much yesterday. He said, I just wanted to leave. He said, I, I can't be without this coffee anymore. <laughs> So I really realize now that I need this coffee because my family is on eggshells when I don't drink it. So I, I am a forever coffee drinker now, and I love it. And I just thank Elevosity for bringing it. I am a believer, again, in my supplements. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you so much. Um, let's reach out to Julie. Julie uh, just put in the chat that she wanted to share what, what's happening for her. Julie, are you out there? Julie, Julie, Julie. All right. Um, so that mute button is apparently really important. Go. Sorry what's about up? that. Can you hear me now? Tell us what is happening for you. Yeah, yeah. It's been a really crazy ride. I got to tell you this. We were living in Hawaii. Our house was eaten by lava, uh, but I had been doing the happy coffee, got through the whole uh, dramatic experience of losing our home. We're now in Washington. Everything's fine. Uh, but long story short, 20 weeks, 65 pounds. And I've been able to get through all the stress of the craziness of life, which happens to all of us. But you know, hello, when a volcano eats your house, that's pretty... Uh, that's pretty dramatic. And my anxiety is much, much better. My, you know, I, I've had issues with uh, blood sugar and my numbers are better than they've been in years. And so I'm just a happy girl all around. 
Awesome. Thank you so much for sharing. It looks like we have all the ladies wanting to share tonight. Wendy Wagner, you out there? Thank well, you. hi. Can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Oh, my gosh. I love this. Uh, you know, when we're tech savvy at this age, you kind of get a, a, a cute little giggle on it, right? Mm -hmm. So, you know what, guys and gals, I was on the Orange County Housewives. And it's a crazy show. And I was asked by someone really cool and important the other day. Ricky knows who I'm talking about. She said, is it really real? And you know what I said? It's very real. And here's why I say that, you guys. When you get to stand on a platform accidentally because of your company, I'm in the beauty business. These women are crazy. They're stressed. And it is like 80% of women in California. They bite their husband's neck off. They get frustrated. They get angry. The kids are screaming. And my clients come into me laying in a beautiful facial chair and they say, is there anything I can do to have a peaceful mood like you? Well, that's my job. So I've got to show them what peace and wellness looks like. Okay. Note to self, Wendy went through death of parents, almost losing my business. My boyfriend had to watch all this happen. My brother, who is like the top cop of the year, went through devastation. So I don't even want to go further. Point being, we went through more stress than I've ever been through in my life. And I was like, Father God, give me an answer. Well, I sometimes, when I wake up in the middle of the night, I search my phone and I found this. God bless Ricky had a video on there, you guys. Put your message out. And I watched it. And I'm able to take this to the housewives. I'm able to take this to my clients. And I've had over 30 clients I'm working with right now saying, what the heck are you doing? And you know what I posted today? My boyfriend started with me and I kind of had to trick him in a cute way. I said, sweetheart, I'm going to lose weight. I know I am. I just knew I was. I trusted it. And I've lost 16 pounds in one month. My guys lost now 18 pounds in one month. We've transformed our little faces and our bodies. And he believed me and trusted me. And you know what? We did it together as a team. But I'll tell you something even more. Our relationship is stronger for it. We have energy and tenderness and peace to get through the tough stuff. And I can tell you what, it's made my life probably, I'm going to say a, a true quote, maybe 70% better because I feel good. My brain's functioning. And I've probably said too much, but thank you guys so much for sharing this with me. And the ingredients are awesome. It's natural. I can tell anybody, try it. Try it for a full week and then go for a month. Let your body get balanced. You will feel great. I feel really good. That's it. I'm happy. Thank you so much, Wendy. You hear these stories, you wonder, are they happy because it's called happy cover? Are they want it happy because they're losing the weight? Or are they, you know, what in the world's going on here? Uh, great story. Do we have any guys out there? We only had Tommy share tonight. Any, any guys want to share their story real quick on hey, what Chris. they're feeling on the product? How are you? Chris, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Share away. Hey, Chris. Thanks. You know, so my name is Dana Fusco, and um, I was introduced to this product. Uh, Tommy had approached me with it, um, and to be honest with you, when he first approached me, to say I was negative is just putting it uh, very lightly and, and, and kindly. Uh, I was not a coffee drinker, um, and I thought it was just a bad timing, so I had thought. You know, I'm somebody that uh, lives with fibromyalgia. I have arthritis. Uh, I take meds for ADHD. Um, you know, there was a point where I really felt like I was taking more prescriptions than, than most grandparents do. And, um, you know, I initially started drinking this stuff. Uh, I went down to convention, kind of got a feel for the company. It was really at first the, uh, the business side that kind of drew me in to really evaluate things and look at things. And um, I started drinking the product and very quickly was impressed with this you know i've spent almost 20 years in the service side uh of the industry and in that side of the industry they always you know speak bad about products and stuff so not only was i not a coffee drinker but i also had this negative stigma 
you know, of uh, instilled beliefs that really weren't mine um, that I had to overcome. And it didn't take much for it to, for that to be overcame because the coffee, the product was some uh, amazing. My first month, I lost 10 pounds. I got off both my high blood pressure meds, and it really inspired, you know, change in me. Uh, it's inspired me to take better care of myself. Um, I was going through some pictures the other day, and like, I can't, I can't believe, like, I got a jawbone here now. Um, you know, it's amazing the transformation that's occurred. You don't realize how fat you are until all of a sudden, like you see a picture of how skinny you are now versus how you were then. I was like, wow, this is crazy. Um, and the best thing is, is like when I went to the doctor's office, you know, the nurse is like, oh, so what are you doing now? Working out, going to the gym? And I was like, none of it. I started drinking coffee and the look on her face, like it's just, it's, it's the most exciting, like it's fun to watch people just be so dumbfounded. Um, but it really is as simple as that. And, you know, some people, it's funny, like, I'll give them a sample and be like, oh, you know, I don't really know about the taste. I'm like, listen, you don't get it. Like, this isn't about, you know, liking the taste of coffee. This is about having something that's going to change your life on so many different levels. Me, personally, it's helped me with my fibromyalgia significantly. Um, you know, I had a bad night, uh, I don't know, I think it was last night or night before, and, and I was like, wow, like it's been so long. And my wife was like, oh, it's been, you know, a few weeks at least. And I was like, that's a big deal because it used to be like every other day. You know, uh, my arthritis is, is significantly better. Um, you know, it's funny, the woman before said that her life is about 70% better. And, and that's about the number that I often tell people is between 70 and 75% better uh, on so many different levels. Um, my clarity and focus at times I've had the most amazing um, just thoughts that are incredible that my ADHD meds have never done anything for me like what this stuff has done for me. So I could spend, you know, quite a while talking about this stuff, but I just wanted to share a little bit with you guys and let you know that, you know, very simply, I, I tell other people that I call this my miracle in a cup because it is definitely shy of nothing but a miracle in my opinion. So um, if you're just looking at this and you're kind of intrigued and want to know if this is something you should try, you've got absolutely every reason in the world to, especially the fact that we've got a 30 day money back guarantee you can't lose. And it's the best thing I ever did. And I'm so glad I overcame my ignorance and uh, gave it a shot. Thanks, Chris. Thank you so much, Dana. We're going to reach out to one more person and then close this bad boy out. Sherry, are you out there? See, so you have your hand up. I am. Hey, Mark. Hey, everybody. It's actually the first time I've been on a Zoom that I got to share my story. I am a type 2 diabetic, and I've been introduced to this by my friend David when I was really depressed because I could not get my sugars under 140 for nothing. When I was going to the gym, I was working out three, four times a week. I was eating all the right things, and I was even going to my doctor going to say, should I get on some kind of anxiety medicine or something? And so I kind of was like writing something online and David seen it and said, I want you to try something. I was like, all right. So he sent me five days worth of dose and I tried it. And within 20 minutes, I started smiling and my daughter's like, what's the matter with you? And I'm like, I don't know. I'm like, this stuff is amazing. What's going on with me right this second? I don't even know what's going on in my brain. And I was like kind of freaking out. I'm like, wow. And <laughs> she's like, wow, mom. And I'm like, yeah, I don't know. Even no, I can't even stop smiling. Well, needless to say, the next day I had checked my sugar and it was 119. I was like, are you kidding me? It's under 120. It has been under 120 for 14 weeks now. I lost 26 pounds. My A1C went from, I think it was like a 9.8 down to a 5.6, all within, well, 12 weeks since I've gotten it taken so far. I do feel so much energy with my grandchildren. Matter of fact, my little granddaughter gets on and makes commercials all the time. She'll see someone at Walmart. This lady was talking how tired she was and everything. And my four-year-old granddaughter says, you're tired, you need happy coffee. And <laughs> she's like, what is that? I'm like, it's coffee that enhances your happiness and gives you energy. And needless to say, I got her as a customer. But 
if you ever want to try something and you're a type 2 diabetic, I'm not giving no medical claims, but what has worked for me is this fantastic coffee. It suppresses your appetite. Well, it suppresses my appetite to where I don't feel hungry very much at all. Me being a diabetic, I have to eat before I drink my coffee because I know I'm not going to be hungry until way after lunchtime. And just to make it short, don't give up if you are on here and you've never tried this product before, get with somebody, just talk to them, listen to what they've got to tell you and try it. It's 30 day money back guarantee and you can't, you can't lose. So awesome. okay. thank you so much for sharing. So guys, what you've heard is, is a story after story after story. And if you're like me, like I didn't even know what the A1 this and numbers and all that stuff. I didn't know what any of that stuff meant. But I, what I got from that story was, this is good stuff. I think I want to try it. And that's what most people feel. And what happens is, is most people, because many of you all might have got on here because you heard about the happy coffee. Many of you all might have heard of, we have a business side behind it. Guys, our business is simply this, you know, sharing what you feel from drinking a simple cup of coffee. So if you're like, well, you know what? I'm not good at sales. Awesome, because nobody wants to be sold but everyone wants to be happy. And if you just look around, watch TV, there's advertisement of commercial after commercial for anxiety medications and this and that. We have a huge problem out there and people aren't happy. And people are just looking at, well, as soon as this happens, then I'm gonna be happy. As soon as you know, I have more money, I'll be happy. As soon as I get married, I'll, you know, I'll be happy. But the bottom line is, is when you're happy first, it's easier to find somebody to get married to. <laughs> when you're happy first, it's easier to go out there and make more money. And, and guys, I shared with you, we were in a very disempowered state when we got started. And over the last year, it, it has not even been a year yet, but our life has had a supernatural turnaround. It's been absolutely amazing. What did we do? We literally shared what was happening and what we were feeling from a cup of coffee. So if you're like, you know, can I do this? Well, let me ask you this. Can, do you have to be trained on how to share how you feel about something? Like if you saw a good movie and told somebody about it, do you have to be trained on how to share what you saw in the movie? No. Just like you don't have to be trained on how to drink a cup of coffee, you already know how to drink a cup of coffee. Oh, by the way, if you're right-handed, stir it with your right hand. If you're left-handed, stir it with your left. How does it work? It's really simple. You just share coffee. You share it with people and they're either gonna feel what they don't. What I can tell you is most people within 15 minutes feel amazing. And when they feel that, don't you think, if somebody started to see that you were either losing weight or you were in a better mood or any of these things, do you think people are gonna say, you know, what's different about you? What's going on? And it really boils down to this. You just share what your story was, how you were affected, and people will come up with a natural logical conclusion of, you know what, that makes a lot of sense. I think I wanna try it. And the bottom line is the worst case scenario is you stay the same. It's the worst thing that can happen. It's a cup of coffee, you're drinking it anyway. Worst case scenario is you stay the same. And the fact that it's so affordable, guys, is, is the reason why this thing has just been going bonkers. So, you know, it really boils down to this. And, you know, being in, in business and on the job, you go to work, you get paid, you, you, you go to work, you get paid, you don't go to work, you don't get what? You don't get paid. What I love about this is I call it roll over money. To go to work or have a job or even to run a business, you have to roll out of bed every day to go out and do the work, right? What I love about this and the way that this works is by sharing a cup of coffee, if they order every single month, it becomes what we call roll over money. Whether you roll out of bed or roll over in bed, you're still getting paid. I don't know about you, but I get pretty fired up about that roll over money where I can roll over in bed and know that I'm still going to have a check. And guys, what I love about this is we have people that are just literally everyday average people. The other day I had a girl, she's like, I've never done anything like this and I have over 100 customers. That just blows me away. And I'm like, well, what did you do? I just shared my story and how I felt and everybody noticed the difference on what kind of great mood I was in. And they were all like, what are you doing? What has changed? Happy coffee. And they all wanted to try it. And I'm just blown away by those kind of things that happen over and over and over. And all we've done is just share those stories. So guys, when you go out and share this with people, you're going to get paid 20%. 
of whatever they're paying for the products, you're getting paid 20% of that. And then when those people start sharing with people, there's this whole override thing. I don't know how it works, but I know that it works well. The bottom line is you do stuff, you get paid. You don't do stuff, you don't get paid. It's called life. This is not some, you know, hey, you just fill out a piece of paper. Next thing you know, you're rich. But what I can tell you is that you really want to impact your life. Go out there and impact people by sharing your story on what the product is doing. And I can promise you, your life will change. Guys, less than a year later, our life has been totally turned around. Our, our, our whole life went from I was late on my mortgage, my air condition went out in my house, couldn't afford to repair it. I had thing after thing after thing that just, it was like a snowball effect of my life going down the tubes. I got on this coffee. I was, it was it's funny, I'll close that with this. I was talking to a friend of mine, Amy, earlier today. And we were talking about how when we got started in this thing, we both were down to our last $50 in our account. And what we've now have happened, I've paid off all of my credit card debt. I've basically been able to get out of debt and we now have money in the bank, more money than I've ever had in my entire life. What did we do? We shared a cup of coffee and how it made us feel. It's really that simple. Guys, there's only three types of people that check this out. Some people are gonna watch this. You might be skeptical and you might say, you know what? I think I just want to try it. Worst case scenario, stay the same. You're number one. You say, I just want to try the product and you know, I'm going to critique it. Great. Awesome. Get with the person, invite you on this call and tell them I'm a number one. I want to try the product. A number two is somebody that says, you know what? I, I not only do I want to try this, but I wouldn't mind getting some free product and, and we have a way you can refer some people to the person that you know put you on this call and by referring some people they'll give you some free product right uh tell them you're a number two you want to basically order the product and maybe get some free product by referring some other people and then a number three is somebody that is watching this listening and they they say you know what this makes a whole lot of sense i know that if i feel as good as what you're saying that i'm going to end up telling other people and you have a choice you can tell people about it and let somebody else get paid or you can tell people about it and you can get paid. If, if you're the type of person that wants to get paid for doing what you're already going to do for free, then you're a number three. Give the person that invites you on this Zoom tonight and let them know, hey, I'm a one, I'm a two, or a three, and get started. Everybody, I appreciate you all sharing your stories tonight. I appreciate you all hearing my story. Um, everybody have an awesome night. I will unmute the call. But give it the person that invites you onto the Zoom tonight and let them know. If you're a one, two, or a three, thank you. Then you're started. Take care, guys. <laughs> Good night, everyone. Good night, Shweta. Bye, everybody. Bye. Have a good night, Bye. beautiful coffee family. Good night. Good night. Great night. Bye, bye. Blessings and abundance to everybody.